Public safety officials say a sprinkler system saved lives when a local senior high rise caught fire. The fire was contained to two apartments, but firefighters said it could have been much worse. Ralph Iannotti has more. The cause of this weekend's fire at the Ebenezer Towers apartment building in the Hill District remains under investigation. But officials say one thing is clear, sprinklers saved lives. The building had a partial sprinkler system with sprinkler heads in the hallways and in the service areas. When the fire uh, started trying to come out through the door, the uh, sprinkler system activated in the hallway and protected the hallway. This allowed the other people on the second floor to use the hallway to escape. Chief Jones recently asked Pittsburgh City Council to approve a new ordinance that would require sprinkler systems in all buildings that are six stories or more. The request came after 75-year-old Mary Robinson was killed last year in a fire at the Midtown Towers, a building that did not have a sprinkler system. City Council delayed a vote on the ordinance after building owners complained about the costs. I understand and, and I am sensitive to that it's going to cost. You know, I get that. It's not, uh, it's not a free thing. If it was free, it would be a no-brainer. But I believe that the benefits far outweigh the cost. My goals here are to reduce the risk to the citizens of Pittsburgh. And if I can reduce the risk to the citizens of Pittsburgh, I reduce the risk to my firefighters. A public hearing on the new ordinance will be held next Monday, where the chief will answer questions. Pittsburgh City Council will then vote on the measure. Sprinklers are like money. The more, the better. Ralph Iannotti, KDKA-TV News.